So to write the name for Fe203, first we need to look on the periodic table and we see that Fe is iron and O is oxygen. We can leave the positive ion, the metal there, iron, just like it's found on the periodic table, but we do need to change the oxygen. So we're going to cross out the Y, G, E, N, and replace that with I, D, E. That gives us iron oxide. But since Fe is a transition metal, we need to write the charge right here in the middle. And we'll do that with Roman numerals. So we can find the charge on each atom of Fe by looking at the oxygen. We know that oxygen always has a minus 2 charge. And since we have 3 of them, 3 times minus 2, that gives us minus 6. We need to balance that out on this side with a positive 6. The way to do that is 2 times some number gives us plus 6. So 2 times plus 3, that'll give us plus 6. That means that each iron atom has a positive 3 charge. And we can write that right here between iron and the oxide. So since it's plus 3, we'll use the Roman numeral 3 here to show that iron, each iron atom, has a plus 3 charge. That gives us the name iron 3 oxide for Fe2O3. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.